The death of Princess Lakana was so tragic, but we appreciate your efforts to save her. The mine! It is collapsing! I left the... my partner down there! I beseech you to help me in this! We were digging, and then there was a rumbling, and the ceiling began to fall. I thought he was right beside me, but alas, he did not emerge. I would go back, but I have inhaled too much dust. I cannot catch my breath. No, and that is what I fear the most. I would never be able to forgive myself. At the very least, though, I must retrieve his supply pack. Everything is in there. Our maps, our water, our food. I cannot survive without these things. Please, go quickly. It would be terrible if the mine collapsed and we did not at least discover my partner's fate. His name is Haidar. I worked for him for many years before he began acknowledging me as his partner rather than his apprentice. I learned much from him, though. I truly hope you are able to get him out of there. No, it is not safe. When a mine becomes unstable like this, there is no way to know when it will collapse completely. It's always a gamble. But you look like you are accustomed to danger and so much... I mean, my partner's life is at stake. Dwemer Gold. It is buried under this desert somewhere. My partner and I worked Kulati mines for some time, but that effort was of no avail. We came here on our own. The fewer people involved, the greater the reward if something is discovered. No, there is no Dwemer Gold down there. We had already decided to give up on this mine even before the rumbling began. We had talked of seeking our fortunes in Bankorai, though now I suppose I might be going there on my own. You are bold to enter a collapsing mine, stranger. Beware lest you share my fate. No, only my skull was crushed, and this by the tip of my partner's pickaxe. We finally found something of value down here, gems. But in that very moment, I saw the price of my life's blood in her beautiful eyes. Yes, and keenly do I feel the need for revenge. In death, I have been granted this opportunity. I have poured my hatred into the gems we found. Give them to her. When I was among the living, I had many questions too. Samsi made sure my questions were put to an end, though. If it will convince you to avenge me, I will answer your questions. What is it you wish to know? They would have been worth a fortune when we found them, but now that they carry my curse, any who take them with greed in their heart will have little time to secure a profit. It is possible Samsi always intended this, or her true self simply emerged when we finally found something of value. I have known Samsi many years, and she has always been jealous. But I have never thought she harbored murderous intentions in her heart. I do not know for certain. It is possible that the gemstones were already cursed before we found them, and this is what caused my spirit to linger. Regardless, I believe achieving vengeance on my killer will bring me peace. The crime of murder is unforgivable. Whether Samsi was influenced or not is irrelevant. She must pay the consequences for taking my life. Very well. I hope you are convinced that my cause is just. Those who would commit murder for coin deserve terrible suffering. My curse will give Somsi a quick and merciful end. Never rest easy while that murderess lives. Uh, 
Oh no! The fact that he is not with you does not bode well. Did you find anything? Was he dead? What about the supply pack? Cursed? They were... I don't understand. But perhaps it is better if I don't. Perhaps this is what I deserve anyhow. Thank you for helping me. And for sparing me the curse. It seems all these years of mining still have yielded me nothing. I think perhaps it is time I considered a new career. Hydar would have been disappointed, but if he has passed, he will never know anyhow. He... he did? I... I do not know what you speak of. I would never kill Hydar. He was my partner, my friend, my mentor. Please! I must be going. A lesson? Yes, fine, maybe. A lesson that this life was never meant for me. Please. Just forget we met here. Forget all this. I'm just going to leave. I'm... I'm sorry, Hydar. 